Another day, another content drop. What's up guys? Welcome back to another MLB video. Today we got some new headliner packs. We also got a new conquest board. Let's take a look at it all. First things first, new conquest board is in the game. We got it. It's called like the symbols map. It's the fifth inning symbols challenge. Complete the symbols challenge to earn 15 program stars for the fifth inning program. Look for the hidden packs, XP, and stubs rewards along the way. This one is going to have some turn-based missions. You're going to have to capture the Cubs in two turns and you're going to have to capture the Yankees in four. Otherwise, it's just just complete the map steal 1 million fans and uh, this is the way it looks there's only one two three four five strongholds to take so as long as you can complete the turn based part of it pretty quickly you're not really gonna have much issue with it it's gonna be a pretty simple map and as always there is going to be hidden rewards so probably I would say a home run derby pack or two there's probably some headliners and balling as a habit packs in there we all know there's hidden stuff in the conquest map and you get program stars you might as well do it now another thing I don't know if they took it out yet but if you go to the fifth inning program yep there it is it's still there uh, we got a little bit of a leak on our hands the sixth inning program bosses for some reason are listed on the 150 star point of the fifth inning program now you can't see the actual cards it still has the three guys Alvarado Floyd and Mazeroski but as far as the card art you can see that for the sixth inning program it's looking like it's gonna be Greg Maddox Jimmy Rollins and I think that's Stan the man everybody's already talking about it on Twitter I want to make sure you guys are in the loop as well man then like I said we we also got a brand new set of headliner packs with the headliner reward being 96 overall silver slugger awards card Charlie Blackman from the Rockies the dude has 115 116 contact 105 power against righties he's only got 71 fielding so he's not gonna be amazing but Charlie Blackman is never amazing in the field the 72 speed is also pretty nice as well for a center fielder I don't trust my headliner luck I really don't how much is he going for he's going for 61 K I like don't even have enough. You gotta be kidding me. Alright, I got rid of some gold cards. I'm up to 70k now, so we're good. There it is. I got Charlie Blackman. Finally! I had to spend 60k for him. I don't think he's worth 60k, but... Hey, it's for content, right? But I think this is the squad we're gonna roll with today. I'm gonna have Charlie Blackman actually at leadoff. I'm gonna play him in center as well. I know, obviously... Uh, Mickey Mantle and Ken Griffey Jr. both give me a better option in center field. Even Cody Bellinger does, but I want to play him in his primary position, and I'm most likely going to sell Charlie Blackman after this video, so let's just throw him at center. I've still got Gary Sheffield in here. I'm actually really close to finishing up Gary Sheffield's prestige program, and I think for this video, we're going to throw Oral Hershiser out there. Oral Hershiser versus Oral Hershiser today, boys. We're taking on the cows. Here we go. Chuck Nasty leading it off. Chuck Nasty? Come on, get over his head. That's got to get over his head. Let's go, Chuck Nasty starting the game off with a double. Mickey? Wow. I know it's low, but I'm all over that one. And yes, I am on All-Star because uh, I suck at ranked seasons, so I dropped in rating. I had to swing at that. Oh my god, that's actually getting through. Uh, I Low-key, it would have been close, but I think it's the smart move to hold up at third. Oh my god, I cannot believe I missed that, dude. Especially with Gary Sheffield, a dude that I need prestige stats with. And then I missed... Uh, wow! Wow! How am I that bad? I'm in an absolute funk in rank seasons lately, dude. I swear. My situational hitting is atrocious. It's just bad lately. Oh my god, Sheffield got up to get that one. Sinker inside the Mike Trout can't handle it oh let's go baby I love that pitch to lefties with Oral Hershiser where's that going oh my god that's out of here okay Ernie Banks I see you with the line drive shot I thought that was gonna get caught at the wall I didn't think that was gonna get out hell yeah let's go so in the comments of this video what do you guys think of Charlie Blackman do you think he's good I mean, I know he's got a pretty solid swing. I usually pick him up anytime I see him in a showdown or something like that. But realistically, he's just a fun bat to use. He's not going to be like an end game card or anything like that. He's just, you know, if you like Charlie Blackman's swing and you want to throw him in for a couple ranked games, this is the type of card that would fit that mold. So I, I like Charlie Blackman. He's not amazing. He's not going to like stay on my squad or anything, but... 
I had to try him out for a game. So let me know what you guys think down in the comments. Next at bat for Chuck. He's one for one with a double. I was on top of it, man. Oh, if I would have got the bad head around and had good PCI on it, that would have been ripped down the line there. <sighs> okay, okay. Jackie Robinson is such a tough out this year. And just like that, we're going to be down by one. Okay. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Are you kidding me right now? Wait, what is going... What is that? What just happened? You gotta make this throw. You gotta make this throw. Get it to third. Get it to third. Get it to third. Okay, I don't know what this guy was trying to do with his base running post home run there, but it was a little questionable. How many cutters am I gonna throw right over the middle? How many? It's unbelievable how many stupid mistakes I make when I'm pitching in this game. There's another one. <sighs> I wonder what it's like to be good at this game. What? That's three in a row. That wasn't even a bad pitch. Oh my God, what is wrong with Oral Hershiser? When did he become like the worst pitcher in the game? Okay, well, uh, we gotta figure it out because we're now down by four runs. And that kind of just happened out of nowhere. He just put three home runs in a row up on the board. And now I'm, like, rattled. Please get through. Oh, my God. Why can't that just go up the middle? I'm going to have to take out Oral Hershiser, dude. I've got to do it. He couldn't even get through five innings for me. That's a hell of a pitch. That's just a dot. Come on, Charlie Blackman. Be a shining spot on a very bad game. Okay, hey, if that's what Charlie Blackman's gonna do, I'll take it. Oh, he overran it. There we go, yes! Mickey Mantle. How is, it's a home run. Is that Ernie's third hit of the day? Oh my god, what just happened in left field? I, hey, I'm getting blessed by some weird things over in left field right now. Wait, what? Hello? Is it... Is it what the hell just happened? What was going on in the outfield and on the base paths and stuff? Ooh, good hit. We're tied, by the way. I'm telling you guys, I'm getting extremely blessed by these weird things happening in left field. I should not be tied with this guy right now. Nope, that's ball four. It's going to set up Charlie Blackman with two guys on here. No, I cannot believe I just swung at that, bro. That's such a bad strikeout. Once again, situational hitting. I have two guys on. The matchup I want. Hershiser's got low confidence, and I just give him that strikeout. Terrible. Oh, Mickey Mantle's not going to get that. He is going to get a triple out of this. Dude, I cannot pitch right now. Why is my pitching just so bad? I should not be pitching to Barry Larkin with a lefty. What am I doing, man? This is why I'm losing all the time in ranks. Just stupid decisions. Remember when I was, like, decent at this game? Remember when I won $1,000 and now look at me. I can't win on All-Star in ranked seasons. <laughs> oh my god, this is actually embarrassing. <laughs> Alright, Cody B. Is that gone? Okay, Robbie. We got two back. We're just going to have to chip away, I guess. Two, three, and four to start off the ninth inning. We're down by three against Dibble. Come on. That's got to get down. That can't be caught. That can't be caught. Thank you. Oh, my God. 
Uh, we gotta stay at first and second. I was gonna try to push it to third, but it's not worth it. Gary Sheffield, the tying run at the plate. Oh, okay, okay, just forget it. On to the next batter. And it's gonna be a double play to end it, because of course. I can't square it up with situational hitting every time. Uh, I just have no mojo in ranked seasons lately, dude. I just can't figure it out. Like, I had a pretty good offensive performance. Eight runs on 17 hits, but the situational hitting legitimately was just not there. And when you give up 11 runs, you're just not gonna win. I, I don't know what's wrong with me. Well, Charlie Blackman, it was a fun ride. Thank you for joining the team for a game. I'm sorry we couldn't get a dub with you. I wouldn't have gotten a dub with anybody, let's be honest. I don't know, boys. My rank seasons vibe is just off. I can't win in this game mode. This is easily the worst season I've ever had in MLB The Show. I'll have to figure it out at some point. I can't keep losing every game. I gotta be due for a win at some point. But hopefully you guys stick around with me when that actually happens. Thank you so much for watching. Drop a thumbs up on it if you enjoyed. Let me know what you think of Chuck Nasty down in the comments. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.